um, uh, another things for uh, for laptop, uh, uh, cell phone, yeah, uh, and I stuff. Uh, it's important uh, for the communication. Yeah, you're right. With uh, staff, uh, my children can uh, take uh, the class, and me too. <laughs> mm -hmm. Okay. I and think, so, I so. think uh, it's very important uh, some things. <laughs> Okay, excellent. Thank you. Now, at what point do you consider a, do you consider a materialistic person? At what point? Because you, I mean, for example, having a car is important, right? As Mark as Marco mentioned, yes. Having a cell phone is not important. Yes or no? Yes. yes. Having having a laptop right now. Having a laptop, yes, for work or studies or study, it's really important now. Yes, having a good internet pro, a pro, a provider or connection, it's important. Now, at, at what point do you consider materialistic? Well, maybe you consider yourself materialistic when you have a, more, than, a, a, more than the things that you already have, okay? Yes, for example, if you have a laptop, and then you and, and then you see that another laptop is 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 coming now in in the market, and you say, "Oh, I want that laptop," okay. And and having a laptop and having a desktop, and then you want something else. So, in my opinion, I think you would be materialistic, right? Mm -hmm. Or having a lot of things that you that that you already ha you have, okay. But then you need more than that. You you are you are being materialistic when, when you have like a lot of things like from from the same kind or the same type. Yes. Uh, 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 for example, and and it will depend on the situation, of course. Okay, it will depend. But having more than enough, it would be materialistic, right? Or oh, one person, oh, one person has a cell phone. Uh, very expensive. Exactly. Maybe, yeah, maybe you will consider, for example, for example, look, students nowadays have the most expensive cell phones, yes or no? Yeah. Yes. I noticed that in my class. iPhones, iPhone is, is that more expensive in these days? I don't know. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, you know, cell phones that that cost that cost more than more than twenty thousand pesos. Okay, so that's way beyond from what what the students need right now. Yes. Um. So, anyways, you guys, thank you for your comments. Okay. Uh, we're gonna move on to uh, the next part, which is possessions. Okay. Uh, possessions look at the topic you guys so so the man in the photo guys is standing with all of his possessions okay L look at that man yeah now what do you think they they are they arrange like this why why do you think all these possessions are like like this like in like in you know, like in cages or like in uh, buckets or something. What do you think is that? What's the reason? Um. I mean, he, his possessions are are inside a box, okay? Or are inside, you know, yes. buckets or something. Why? Why do do you, do you think his possessions are arranged like this? Why? Okay, I want to tell you. Come on, give me your opinions. Uh, uh, Marquito, Andrea, what, what do you think? He put all of his stops in boxes. What do you think he's going to do? Yeah. The things in the box. 
Um, yeah, yeah. The, the things in the box are his possessions. But why do you think have his possessions in boxes? Why? Why? What? What is he going to do? To. Uh, well, save it. Save. Okay, to save it. Okay, what else, guys? Any others? Mm -hmm. um. I mean, just look at the picture and give me your idea. I don't have other idea. Okay, well, think creatively, you guys. Why do you think people, when people put things in boxes, what do they do? Uh, may, may... Uh, move to, a, to another house. Okay, they, maybe he's moving, okay, yes. What else, uh, Marco? Yeah. Okay, maybe uh, he, uh, doesn't like doesn't uh, like things, maybe like another things, uh, okay. and so uh, he likes uh, he likes uh, he, uh, he likes uh, having room. Okay, he needs more space. Uh, space. Okay. Uh, yeah. Okay. So he's he's giving he's giving them away to charity, maybe. Maybe. He, or he, uh -huh. Or maybe there are there are things that 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 he doesn't use and he wants to throw them away, maybe right? Uh, yes. Yeah. Or maybe he he's putting he's putting his boxes in order, right? Maybe. Yeah, yeah, maybe organized. Exactly. Maybe he's organized. They use the yeah. box. Exactly. Yeah. Yes. So, okay, you guys, very good. Now, guys, well, actually, this man, this man, well, well uh, the one you see, the one you see here, uh, is a uh, Michael Landy. Okay, he is Michael Landy, a British artist. Okay, and let's see everybody read about what he says. Okay, let's read what he says about one of his artistic projects. Look, okay, it's an artistic project, the, the thing that he's doing. Okay, now, can you, I'm going to give you just a minute, like very quick, can you read it individually, please? Come on, let's go. And underline any new vocabulary you see, please, come on. Okay, you guys, so. Guys, what's his project? Michael Landis project. I think this Troy all his possessions. That's the project? No, let me check. It's his yes, goal. No. It's his goal, yeah. It's like a, it's his project. Oh, yes. It's his it's goal. His... Yes, exactly. Goal is yeah. the same for project. Well, her goal, his objective, okay. But yeah, he's he it's for for him it's an it's an artistic project, okay? So he's a British yes. artist, right? Now, uh, okay, yes. we, you guys, very good. So 
Guys, could you do the same things with your possessions? Uh, about destroy? No, yeah, exactly. Yes. Could you do the same thing with your possessions? Uh, no. Yes. Yes, he has, uh, he has uh, many items, possessions. No, uh, but the, the articles uh, uh, said uh, he has about uh, 700 items. Okay. Yeah. His project is to destroy all his possessions. Okay. Now, could you do the same with your old possessions? Could you destroy all your possessions? And uh, no, in my case, no. Why? Mm -hmm. Because some possessions have a feeling for me and it's very important. Okay, <laughs> yes. Okay. Now, but maybe there are some things that, that you could destroy. Maybe, for example, yeah, for example, for example, okay. uh, uh, things that you could never destroy is, I don't know, maybe a special present that your mother gave you or your father or someone special, right? But what would be yes. some things that, that you could destroy? Uh, uh, so Something that is very old and I okay. never use. Never used. To. I have I have a I have a PlayStation 2 <laughs> that I don't use like for many years and I would be glad to destroy it. <laughs> oh, yeah. yeah, I have a PlayStation 2 and yeah, I will be glad to destroy it. I, it's been like it's been over there for more than how, how long? For more than six or seven years. Oh my God, it's yeah, a very it's, long time. Yeah, I know. <laughs> okay, you guys. <clears throat> okay, you guys, so. Uh, let's everybody continue, okay? Now, let's look at Jeannie, guys. Uh, Diana, can you read the instruction? B. Okay. A or B? A, B. Okay. Listen to Jeannie talk about the article. Did she get the fact right? Okay. Yes. Now, this lady, this is Jeannie. She's talking about Michael. Yes. She's talking about Michael. Now, uh, but look, is it true everything she says here? Is it true? Okay. Did she get the facts right? I mean, is the information here right according to the article? Let's listen, okay? And please underline the information that is not true about the article. Is that clear, you guys? E Yes, is that clear? Okay, very good. So let me let me give you let me uh, share. Okay, let me know if you listen. Okay, here we go. Page eighty six, unit nine. Yes. Material yes. world. Okay. Lesson yes. A, possessions. One, getting started. C, listen to Ginny talk about the article. Which facts didn't she get right? Do you agree with her opinion? I read about this British artist who came up with a really unusual art project. He said his goal was to destroy all his possessions and that he wanted to bury them in a parking lot. Can you believe it? He explained that he had been making a list of everything he owned and that it came to 17,000 items and that he had made an artistic decision to shred and granulate everything. You can actually watch him destroying all his things. Someone explained to me that this is performance art. 
I guess this guy really hates materialism. So do I, but I can't throw anything away. Just the same, maybe I'll stop buying so much stuff. You know, I wonder why he didn't just give his stuff away. But I think it's a really interesting idea. I'd like to know more about this type of art. Page 87. 2. Grammar. Reported speech. Okay, you guys. Now, look at, the, look at what she says one more time and tell me what things are not true about the, about the article. Come on. Okay. Uh, the number of items in the first, okay. the, uh -huh. first uh, the first article said uh, seven hundred, and the second article uh, seven 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 thousand and six. Ah. Sorry, 7,000. Yes. In, in the second article, uh, I have. It said, um, uh, um, 17. 17,000. Uh -huh. 17, uh, yeah, 17,000. Mm -hmm. Okay, excellent. That's one. Okay, that's, that's one. And I have other. What is the other? Um, for example, in the first article, well, in the second article, say he went to bury then in a parking lot. And in the article, it didn't say anything about it. They didn't say anything about burying? Uh -huh, about burying. But here, Ginny says he's going to bury them. Yes. But in the article for the huh? for the Michael and didn't say anything about this. About what? About to bury them in a parking lot. Exactly. The difference, okay, they talk, they both talk about bury them, but the difference is in the place, yes? Where where does uh, Michael Landy is going yes. to bury his things? Where? Um, he wants to bury them where? Michael Landy. Scan the text and find the word and find the word bury. Do you see the word bury in the in the in Michael Landings? Uh, oh yes, yes. Okay. I want to bury them on ground in a shopping center. Yeah, underground. 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 Exactly. In a shopping center. So those things are the things that are different. Okay? Yes. Those things, again, are the things that are different. Now, let me tell you something, yes? Uh, look, at, look at what he says. Can you, can you tell me, please, uh, um, Bayona? Uh, he said something. I have been making what? I have look been at Michael Landry. Yes, Michael yes. Landry, uh-huh. Can you please read it so I can write it down here? Uh, but what part? The whole sentence. I have made a conceptual decision no, as I an have artist. Been, no. I have been making in the first part. I have been making an, I'm making an, an inventory. inventory of everything. 
huh? Of everything. Uh -huh. What else? Everything. Everything I own. Uh -huh. What else? And it comes to seven thousand. Oh, yes, seven thousand. And six. Seven thousand and six. And six. Uh, items. 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 Yes, uh, items. items. In the first article, uh, he lied uh, destroying articles. Uh, in a shopping center in the separate report, uh, it said uh, he lies uh, destroying islands, art, islands, articles, uh, islands mm -hmm. in, uh, 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 in a parking lot. Exactly, in the parking lot. Very good. Yes, one thing is in the park. Jeannie said in the parking lot. In the parking lot, but Michael said what he said, what the real thing he said is that he was underground in a shopping center. Guys, now look, can you find can you find this sentence, this similar sentence in Genie? Come on. Um he had been making a list of everything he owned and that it came to okay. so, 17 he, items. Okay, he explained what? Come on, he explained that he explained that he had been making mm -hmm. yes making a list of everything mm -hmm. everything he owned he owned it yes and that it came to 70,000 70, items Seventeen, teacher. Seventeen. Seven. Yes, seventeen. Seventeen or seventeen. Seven thousand and six. Yeah, right. Seven thousand and six. No, but it, but Jenny says in seventeen more. Uh huh. And seventeen. Really? Yes, Ginny says 17,000 17, items. Ah, okay, okay, okay. Yeah, it came to uh, a... Ah, okay, yes, yeah. Okay, but, but in this case, but in this case, we are going to replicate what we see here in the first sentence, okay? Okay. Yes. So, good. Yes. Now, guys, let me now. Oops, what did I do here? Okay, here, like this. Now, guys, here, this is a. This is what I'm going to take this off here. Okay. This is Michael. This is Michael Landy, right? He was the one that 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 was talking to was talking to the uh, you know was talking to the people right Mark, this is michael landy uh, and this is michael landy real words or actual words okay so when you when yes. you put when you put these quotations okay when you put these quotations that means that it's what the person actually said okay yes is what the person actually said. And here, well, here I'm missing at the end, here, the quotations, okay? So, okay, we have quotations, okay? And also, look at this part, guys, here. It says, I have been making, look at the tense. This tense is present perfect, Continues, right? Yes. Yes. And look, look how look how Ginny said that. He explained that he what? Uh, 
been making. Had been making, exactly. So, guys, this is direct speech. And this is reported speech, okay? So, in reported speech, guys, you report what other person said, okay? For example, Ginny is reporting what Michael said in the article, yes? So, and notice, guys, and notice that when you report, okay, you change the tenses. For example, present, for example, have, present, from the present perfect, changes to past. Past, past perfect, perfect continue. continue. Okay, notice that. And notice that, for example, if I say, for example, a, for example, I don't know. I, I will give. I will. I will write another example. Okay, about about Michael Landy. This is Michael, here. Michael Landy says, "I have, I have, a lot of stuff." No. Okay. This is what Michael said. Remember, direct speech has quotations. Always, always have quotations because. It's what the other person said, yes? Now, now what's the reported speech in this? What's the reported speech? Uh, Example, look, oh, wait. He, okay. He has a lot of stuff. Okay, so. He said. He said, he said that he had a lot of stuff. Uh, yeah, the that, uh, the that is optional. Yes, the oh, that, okay. the reported speech is always optional. You can say, he said he, uh, no, he said, no, sorry. He said that, it's here. He said that he, okay. Oh, he said he, now. He said he had. Now, hey, yeah, exactly. This is, what, what tense is this? Uh, in present. present. Exactly. Now, present changes to past. Past, past simple. Present simple changes to past, past simple. simple. Okay? Yes? So, okay. present simple changes to past simple. So, Diana, how can you complete this? He said that uh, he... He said that he had a lot of stuff. Exactly, very good. A lot of stuff. Okay, yes. And and you know, and in the in reported speech, you don't put quotations, right? Yes. Now mm -hmm. uh, okay, very good. So guys, this is this is an introduction of what we're going to see, okay, later in the in the grammar chart. Mm -hmm. But I need you to keep in mind, right? And guys, here. This is an introductory verb, okay? For example, in this example, I'm using said, and it's the most common. He said that he, that he had a lot of stuff, but there are other introductory verbs. For example, look at Gina. Gina said, he explained, he explained, okay? Yes, he explained. He, uh, he thought, okay, yes. So it will depend on the context, but only right now check the, the, how the, the tenses change. For example, present changes to present simple, changes to past simple. Uh, a, a present perfect continues, past perfect continues, okay? All right, guys, any questions until this moment? It's okay? No. It's right. Okay, okay, very good. So I will stop sharing this uh, these notes. Okay. And I need you to go to the book to the next exercise. Complete the sentences to report what Michael Landy said. Now you are going to use reported speech. Okay. Can you complete it? Come on. One, two, and three.
Uh, do you guys finish or do you need more time? I finished. Okay, Diana, can you read the first, please? A. Landis said that his goal was to destroy all his possessions. Exactly, very good. Was. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, uh, Marquito, can you read number two? And he said he uh, wa wanted to bury his positions, but he wanted no. Uh, He didn't have the right place yet. Okay, but he uh, um, he hadn't the right. Hadn't. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Thank you. He hadn't found. Exactly. He hadn't found. Very good. And Andrea, number three, please. She said something. She said something where where hard to find with like his fire cut. Exactly. Very good. Excellent, guys. So here. We are changing the tenses. Is, was, want, wanted. Okay. Okay, didn't find, hadn't found. Okay. Are, where. So, very good, you guys. Now, guys, now look at the reported speech now. Look at the, look at the examples, yes. David, can you help me read the chart, please? When you report. When you report the things people say, the verb tense often shifts back. Direct yes. speech, mm -hmm. Michael Landy. My goal is to destroy all my possessions. The reported yeah. the speech, he uh -huh. said that. His goal was to destroy all his possessions. Mm -hmm. Direct speech. I want to bury them underground. And reported speech. He wanted to bury them underground. Then direct speech. My father gave me a, a sheepskin coat. And reported speech. His father had given him a sheep skin coat. I haven't found the right shopping center. And the report of the speech, he hadn't found the right shopping center. The last one about direct speech, I have been making an inventory. Report okay. the speech. He has been making an inventory. Exactly. Thank you. Very good. So, guys, here I'm writing. If you look at my presentation, um, look at the tenses that shifts back. When they say that shift back, that means that they change. Yes. A present perfect. Present perfect. Mm -hmm. Okay, past perfect.
Present perfect continuous changes to. Okay. Exactly. Now look how they change, guy. How they shift. They shift the back. For example, my goal is, my goal was. Okay, present. And here you write past. For the verb be is was. I want to bury, he wanted to bury. Notice that, for example, want to, it's infinitive. Want to bury, we have two verbs. So the first verb is the one that changes. For example, I want to bury, he wanted to bury, okay? And so on with the others, okay? Look, so on with the others. Past changes to past perfect. Present perfect changes again to past perfect, okay? And present perfect continues changes to past perfect continues. Okay, you guys? Mm -hmm. Now, what about modal verbs, guys? What about modal verbs? Yes? Uh, Marco, can you help me read the others, please? Genie. Okay. Okay. Uh, I can't throw anything away. Maybe I stop uh, buying some more stuff. Uh, she said she couldn't throw anything away. Maybe would stop buying uh, some more stuff. Okay, exactly. So can changes to could, right? Yeah. And will changes to would. Exactly. Yes. Now, guys. Now, this is when you when you report past information. Okay. When you report past information, but. Look, what happens when the information is still true, okay? When you report information that is still true, the verb tense often remains the same. So you don't change, you, you don't shift back. For example, someone explained to me that this is what you call performance art, okay? Yes, because this is, this is, something, this is something true. Yes, this is true. Okay, because it's how people consider it. Not people consider it in the past, not will in the future, in the present, because this is still true. Yes? Now, guys, any questions about this until this moment? No. It's okay? All right, very good. Now, uh, all right, guys. Well, we're gonna move on to the next exercise, okay? Here are some things, okay? Here are some things people said about their possessions. Complete the sentences to report what they say and compare with a partner, yes? So look at the first, you guys, come on. Yes, look at the first. It says, um, okay, can, Diana, can you read it, please? Okay, number one, yeah. I'm not at all materialist. I have very few possessions. Okay. Uh, I think the answer is a friend of mine said that he wasn't at all materialist and that he had very few possessions. Exactly. Very good. Excellent. Yes. Uh, yes, very good. So look at the verb here, the ver look at the main verbs, I'm and have, okay? So again, can you read it, can you read it, Diana? Okay. A friend of mine said that he wasn't at a materialist and, and that he had very few possessions. Materialistic, uh huh, and he had, and he had very 
few possessions. Okay? So come on, you guys. Let's complete the others, okay? Come on. It's okay, guys. Yes, it's okay. Okay. What about the others? Uh, David and Marco, you finished? One okay. minute. Okay. All right. Okay.
they finished. Yes. All right, um, Marco, can you read number two, please? Okay. Uh, my closet are all full, but I can't stop uh, buying new clothes. Mm -hmm. Someone at, at work told me that her uh, closet were all full, but she couldn't stop buying new clothes. Exactly, very good. I will I will be writing the, the, the tenses, okay? Couldn't stop, mm -hmm. very good. Yes, uh, David, number three. I'm always throwing things away. Once I threw out an antique base by mistake. My aunt said that she was throwing things away and that once she threw out an antique space by mistake. She was always throwing things away that she, that once she I think that's the, the same, she threw. No, it's in, remember, it, the verb through, it's in past. It's in past, through, uh, throughout. So past simple changes to past perfect. Uh, she, she had through, through, through. Thrown. Thrown. Thrown, thrown, uh-huh. Yes, she had thrown out an antique base by mistake, okay? Okay. Number four, uh, continue please, um, uh, Andrea. Okay. We're in bed because we've spent too much money on the stuff for, uh, for our apartment. My brother told his wife they, that they were in debt. Mm -hmm. Okay. Because that, that they were, they no, were it says, in, no, no, it says we've spent. It's present perfect. Present perfect, in the same way as past simple, they change to past perfect, okay? okay. So they had, had spent exactly. yeah. too much money. Exactly, too much money, yes. Marquito, come on, number five. Okay. I have uh, a huge collection of comic books that I just don't have room for. One of my teachers told me that he had a collection of comic, comic books that he just didn't have room for. Ah, uh, that he... The, he just didn't have room for. Excellent, very good, thank you. Diana, number six, please. Okay. We have to have a jar say to get right of all the junk we've been budging at jar. Thanks. 
The answer is my, my neighbors say they had to have a yard say to get rid of all the junk. The junk. Okay, but it says will. Will yes. changes to? Wait. No, will changes to? Would. 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 They would. Yes. They would. Have to. Have, have to have a yard. Huh? A yard say to get right of all the junk. They say. Please. That they, it they says we had exactly had they had had been buying. They had been buying exactly very good. Buying. That they had been buying. Okay, yes. Mm -hmm. At yard sales. Okay, at yard sales. Okay, excellent, you guys. Very good. So. Uh, oh, I'm sorry, you are here. Stay up. Have to have. Okay, guys. Okay, so we're going to stop here. But before we stop, okay, guys, what did you practice today? Come on. Mm, about you... how to uh, report the speech. Okay, report a speech. And how the tenses shift, right? They, they shift or they change, right? Yes. Yes, you guys, excellent, very good. Yeah, well, mainly we talked about this, but also, what was the topic? In lesson A, what uh, was the topic? Possessions. Exactly, possessions. we talked about possessions, right? Yes, we talked about possessions, exactly. Now, uh, guys, we're gonna stop here. For homework, you will have the next pages. Uh, 66 and 67. Exactly. That's the homework for you guys. Okay. That's the homework for you, for everybody. Okay. For you to do it. Now, listen up. Okay.